Oh, Panel Fitness is a complete uh, centerman. You know, he does everything real well, you know, whether it's um, setting up his teammates for goals, you know, making everyone around him better. He also has the ability to uh, beat guys one-on-one -on -one and score highlight type real goals himself. Uh, you know, he was a valuable asset to his team because, because he played in every situation, every role, you know, whenever his coach needed a, a big shift or a big, you know, scoring chance or needed a goal, he was always the one guy that uh, was always first over the boards. Um, you know, he was, uh, he's a smart hockey player understands the game and you know he just he does he just does everything well he's one of those players that coaches are going to love because he has great hockey sense and the skill and the skating and this, you know the smarts to go along with all that as well um you know he just understands the game so well and that's that's something that i know ohl coaches and general managers are looking for because it's a tough skill to teach um you either have it or you don't it's a hard skill to teach so he's he's a player that totally understands the game he's always on the right side of the puck he plays you know he understands what to do in his own end and then in the offensive zone he uses his creative his creativity to uh, generate offense yeah some of the things that he's he did this year he was um he was on the canadian youth olympic team he made that team um as an elite group in canada came out flying in both their games but here uh canada you know still has not yet played their best game and the question is can the u.s raise their level from what has been optimal so far Yes, stars and strikes, and they're generally the team that are setting the pace. Right now, they're having to manage this Canadian side. Oh, right in front, and a chance, and another chance. Yeah. Here comes Canada with numbers. Nice bit of work, great defending yeah, so there. And if he maintained control of the puck, I think it's a game on, isn't it? But yeah. as soon as he kind of mishandles it, and then he's looking back, back yeah. easily found a way past Billy in the Canadian goal. Yeah, three goal lead, yeah. especially another one late in the period. Uh, could have been devastating, but Canada now coming the other way, and that was a big save off the deflection. Canada has owned the last few minutes of this Snugger period. Route. The captain doing everything. And now they have it and a chance in front, and uh, but they play with sticks. They can't use the shovel. You're right, but shovel it and goal right there like that. Yeah, they'll oh, do it. That was close. And the rhythm counts, doesn't it? What it is is a, is a team trying to gain an advantage hacking because they have this defense for the U.S. can take a, a, a load. And they can take a battle uh, at the dump and chase game. They can manage that too. That one hasn't oh, worked out though. Oh, the referee gets in the way. Oh my goodness, that was, was almost there. huge. And, and here it's comes six Cesar. on four. Minute 30 to go, two minutes to go, period three. It is all here, all now. Under a minute to go. There's 20 seconds to go. Over 30 seconds in the game. The Canadian net is empty on oh, another redirect. They can't put it in. And as well, he, you know, he was the leader and, you know, the, the driving force of his team that uh, ended up winning the GTHL playoffs and would have been the number one seed um, for the GTHL at the OHL Cup. I'm a two-way centerman. I play a full 200-foot game. I like playing in all three zones. Um, I'm a, I like to use my playmaking ability as most, like setting up guys, finding that backdoor pass, stuff like that. I'm more of a lead-by-example kind of guy. I can be vocal as well, but... Yeah, I mean, leading by example is kind of my thing, and I'll obviously bring that to the table as well. I'd best describe myself as a two-way centerman. I'm so honored to be drafted by the Niagara Ice Dogs, and I'm looking forward to coming into the building, stepping on the ice, and playing in front of all the amazing fans.